So, I have been inspired to create my own version of a Midori. If you're not familiar with a Midori, um, it is a very expensive um, traveling, it's called the Midori Traveler's Journal, and it is very cool. You must Google it if you've never heard of it. So, here's my version. Um, the real one is made out of a very thick leather and I didn't have any thick leather so I used what I had um, this is quite flimsy and this is actually my second one the first one did not work out so well so um, what I ended up doing to um, kind of stiffen the leather and and make it uh, less floppy and yeah the floppy just did not work um, I took a piece of um, sticky back canvas and I stuck it to the back of the leather and it worked really well. I painted it first with some acrylic paint um, which gave it a nice kind of leathery feel and then uh, I went ahead and just stuck it to the leather. It seems to be sticking really well. Now I like it. the real Midori doesn't have a flap but I just wanted a flap so um, I, uh, I left a little tail there and I have an elastic to go around it to keep it closed and right now I, I don't know what I'm going to put in it to be honest but I have a couple of um, moleskin um, uh, notebooks and I found this uh, clear plastic um, I guess it's a it actually was from the dollar store it had a bunch of little paint containers in it so I um, have got that in there it's not it's just kind of in there though so I don't think it's gonna end up staying like that I'm not sure what to do with it but I might just cut this tip off and use this half for like pencils and stuff pencils pens that kind of thing so I used um, for the elastics I used some of this stuff it's, it's called just thick elastic cord and got I forget what I paid for it I got it a long time ago at Michael's but it seems to work really well and um, yeah I'm pretty happy with it I'm gonna make another one for a gift um, actually two more I think for gifts so that's my Midori. Closes up.